What up, YouTube, and welcome back to The Long Dark. Today, we're going to head to the back end of Mystery Lake and kind of search the areas we haven't already checked. Uh, the idea is I want to get some saplings and some hides from the deer carcasses in the area in preparation for smelting and getting some mid-tier or end-tier gear. If you enjoy the episode, please drop a like. It helps me out very, very much. And with the intro out of the way, let's get started. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of The Long Dark. Uh, today, I think we are going to head to Trappers quick and uh, go get our hacksaw. Pretty sure it's there. Let's uh, double check. Uh, yes. Uh, looks like we left the hacksaw at Trappers. Um, if I recall correctly, it's on the workbench. Um, and... The reason I want to grab that today is I think we need to do just a little bit more housekeeping before we head over to Muskeg. Now, I've been thinking about whether or not I want to go to Muskeg or if I want to go to the Riken. I kind of want to go to the Riken just because I feel like it would be more interesting. Um, but I don't think we have enough scrap here. Yeah, that's only like five pieces, six pieces. Um, seven. To be exact uh we got seven scrap here um the rest of it is all in musk egg so i don't really want to go gather all the scrap again so likely we'll go back there but before we do i want to head uh to trappers get the hacksaw and then i'd like to kind of go around and look for some saplings and also i know there's a couple like deer carcasses in the uh oh he found me oh can we keep some distance from him and they're all over there's one up there too uh, i'm gonna try to lead him without using a match but if we have to i've got a couple torches on me uh but i wanted to there's a couple deer carcasses around like there's the one over by the train there there's another up by the broken down forestry lookout that's that way um and there's probably a couple more in the area somewhere those two i believe are guaranteed to spawn in the game so the idea is let's go to those uh locations and if we can maybe try to get the deer hides get the guts get the meat off the deer uh maybe try to get some ptarmigans and get like a little bit more um, set up for our journey back to Muskeg. I wonder if I could lose him through these trees if I were to just run. I don't want to use the sprint too much. wonder if that worked. <laughs> We're going to find out. Uh, there might be some saplings in this area, too. I think I've seen them before. I think we actually lost them. That's pretty good. Um, like, over here-ish, kind of on the outskirts. I need to eat, too, before I lose well-fed again and uh, delete this game. Let me see here. Make sure he's still not on me. I'm not seeing anything else. Okay. Let's eat real quick. Uh, yeah, let's just eat this. We don't have to worry about it for a while. I'd like to grab some ptarmigans too, if possible. Because um, I did want to make the broth. Would be pretty... Uh, that would be a good move if we could get some. Uh, it's pretty simple. I think last time we checked it out, it's... Uh, like some salt and some and uh, two pounds of ptarmigan meat and some water. Pretty simple to make, uh, but I believe it's like 750 calories if we are able to make it. So having a jar or two of that would be pretty cool. I'd be happy with that. Get us some food, uh, keep us stocked up on uh, our calories. 
that's like a day's walk and a night's sleep in terms of calories, so. I do want to grab these sticks, but I don't want to be up on the ledge in case there's any wolves. Not that we need a fire right now. Oh, there's some more birch bark, though. I'd like to make some more teas. We need to... That's something I need to prioritize today, too. We don't have... Uh, many ingredients. I think I used all the reishis last time. Uh, in the last part. And I don't have any rose hips. I don't have anything else to make teas with. And so we need to do that. We're going to need to restock... Um, I can't be just handling this cold outright every time. We're gonna want to have the teas to keep us warm on these on these journeys. So that's uh that's on the to-do list today as well. At least the weather's clear today. Last uh, yesterday the the weather was just non-stop snow. It was killing me. And I wonder if the coal reset in here at all. I don't know how long it takes, if it's like 30 days or 5 days or 8 days or whatever. I'd like to check though real quick. We're walking through and we'll warm up a little bit. Just take the edge off. Alright, so I just searched the whole cave real quick. I don't know what the respawn rules are for the coal, but I did find 6 pieces. So, um... There was four over by the fire pit that's in the main room. And then there were two pieces off in one of the little caverns that I am certain I searched last time we walked through here. Um, so I feel like they may have respawned back in. But it's quite possible that I overlooked them as well. It just feels like a, a large number of pieces to have overlooked. But I'm not the most observant, so... It is certainly possible that I just missed them the first time. That did tank a little our food a little bit more than I wanted it to, but not much I can do. It's already done. Uh, let's we, we are here at Trapper, so let's make our way over. I want to get back inside. Uh, we just lost hyperthermia risk, and we just got it back, so. Let's get inside. I, you know, the coal is going to help us warm up if we want. Um, and I do need to eat. Um, I got the cattails, but I'm not going to hang out here very long, if at all. I just would really like to just get the, the cold settled um, and maybe see if we can make a tea or two. So that way we can uh, get out of here. This is almost cured. Those are cured. Perfect. Cool. The lantern's here. Mag lens. Um, I guess let's uh We're gonna find out if we eat two of these or one. Oh, we really do just eat one. Okay, that's cool. Let's drink our water. I'm gonna take a quick nap here. Uh it's gonna warm up. We'll we'll increase our condition a little bit. One hour I'll probably do. Do I want to do two? No, it's almost midday. An hour. Sh <sighs> All right, let's just do one hour and see how we fare. All right, fire's good. Let's put that out and away, and let's add some fuel to this this thing. I'll add a couple minutes here. Forty-five minutes probably do. Let us. Heat that up. And that's reishi. And let's see what else we have we can uh, make for tea. All I have is the birch bark. Let's craft it. Put that down there. Let's make another one. Let's cook the tea. Ooh, no, actually... Let's make some more of that. And I will put the, uh, that's good. Yeah, I'll put the cooking pot down. 
and we'll make the uh, the birch bark tea out of that. 19 minutes on the stove. All right, we'll refuel the fire here. Let me. I had. I found two torches along the way. Let's go ahead and harvest these. can uh take that let's do another one. Oh, i didn't prepare them okay that's fine where is our birch bark under medical yes we'll drop that uh give it to me Thank you nine minutes there and how much time do i have 17 minutes i think we can make one more so i'll do that I need to eat. Again. Okay, we can take that. Let's go ahead and uh, cook that birch bark. And I think I might... Yeah, I might add some more sticks here. Just do all of them. And let's make another... Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, I'm out of flour. Dang it. Never mind. I should have checked that before, because that's the whole reason I just extended the fire here. Alright, I do want to eat one. And we'll let that tea go. Those are good. Let's just check. Did I ever search this locker? I did. The backpack is empty as well. Yeah, we're gonna... We're pro I've already searched this whole area gonna end up getting out of here uh we're good on water yeah i'll take another one i'd like to get a good supply going somewhere these are fine here these are cured which is great i might as well take them with me now i'm not planning on doing the crafting here most likely gonna end up crafting at uh the camp office so I don't know if I want to leave these here. I also don't know if I want to take them with me right now. How are we on weight? 11 pounds? What if I grab a deer hide? Like I'm planning to and I grab the saplings? I'm not sure we want to... If we want to do that. Let's take that. Let's take the cooking pot. Uh, we will... Keep these on me. I'm going to end up drinking that. Let's pull the torches. Just to have them. I can always drop them if we don't use them. But I want to make sure we're not messed with by the wolves. Probably should have checked outside before turning that off. We're fine. Oh my god. Drink this. All right, cool. Let's head off. Let's um, we're gonna head out this way. It is midday. It's gonna get warmer as we go, uh, or it should be. It should do. It's gonna get warmer as we go, or at least it should. Uh, we're going to head up this hill here. I'm going to grab these sticks along the way. Grab any birch bark I can along the way. And the idea is to... Go look for the saplings. And... The idea is to go look for the saplings. And to look for... Um, any carcasses we can. The only thing with the carcasses is I don't really it's gonna take time and there's no real shelter in either of these areas and I don't like that it's snowing we're gonna be wet which makes us colder the other downside is the uh, blizzard could pick up at any time when it's snowing so we're running that risk as well I don't want to be caught out in a blizzard if I can avoid it 
But let's see what happens. We're gonna head down this way. Hopefully there's no wildlife along the way. Everybody's in their homes. And we'll head down. This weather does feel like it's picking up more. I don't know if I should be out here right now. Uh, I should be able to make it back if the weather does pick up. Like, I'm pretty familiar with Mystery Lake. I should be able to get around. Unnamed Pond's right over there. I just can't get turned around. Okay. I don't see anything of interest down here. No reishis, no rose hips. Uh, there's a bunch of sticks. Which uh, could be useful. We do need some fuel. I have the coal on me though. So worst case scenario, we have what we need there in order to start a fire. But I'm going to grab these sticks if I can. I wish I was warmer. <laughs> like, there's just something about like playing the game and being like, alright, we're going to get firewood today and just going out and and casually gathering firewood and bringing it back to your house. I never seem to reach that point in the game where it's like, we're just doing a casual wood run. Let's do a casual food run. Need to bag me a moose or a bear or a, a 20 pound deer where I can, you know, know that food's good for a little while. We are losing food quickly. I'm going to probably eat a couple cattails and make sure that we're good, but we're here at Unnamed Pond now. There's a rabbit. Oh, uh, there's a... Oh, the bear's out, too. Not what you want to see. Let's see here. I need to eat. Eat a couple of these. I don't want to mess with the bear today. He's walking. Hmm. I would like to search these logs. What to do? He's over there. I'm not seeing any saplings either. He's crossing the ice. We're pretty cold. I'm trying to think. Oh, these are cold already. No bueno. So the bear's there. He's going that way. We might be alright. If I recall correctly, there is also like a house. Off, off that way. Oh, he turned around. Why are you turning around, man? <laughs> what the hell? He keeps turning around every time I go a direction. Pick a direction, man. Now I'm cold. Wasted my time. There is a... Um, I've only been there once or twice. But there is a building, kind of like draft dodgers type of like hideaway um obviously it's not draft dodgers that's in pleasant valley but there is a building over there where also there's a a possibility for a moose to spawn i'll just grab these since i'm right here i'm not going to come back here very often i don't want to go really out onto the ice with that bear Even though he's pretty far. Um, but we could go up back that way. And go to that building. And there might be some saplings. Oh, he's turned around again. Um, there, there might be some saplings up that way. But we could spend the night in the building. And know that we're, uh, 
we're pretty much in the clear in terms of the weather. The other thing I could do is make a snow shelter if we really get stuck. I've never done that before, but we could do it. Let's walk up the hill, though, and see if we can... Yeah, here it is. It's not that far. This is a cool little cabin hidden off here in the woods. We could aim to just stay here tonight. Probably a solid move, considering it's getting darker. And we're cold as hell. Shouldn't need a fire to sleep here. And I'm just looking around. Quick little survey. More feathers are always good. Oh, there's a pry bar here too. Okay, he's empty. Dennis, you've been letting me down lately, man. You don't have anything, not even a pair of socks. Let's go inside. Hold. Oh, hey Dennis. How'd you get in here? What you got? Alright, nothing. Yeah, there's not much in here, but we're warm. Nothing in the metal container either. Uh, let's see. We got a bunch of books. They can stay here. Anything else we want to drop real quick? Not, not particularly. We got 10 pounds of room. I'll drop these sticks for now. Oh, I got six. I got six reishis, which means we could uh, make we could prepare them over the evening today. And uh, I see a sapling back there. We could prepare them over the evening today. And um, and then from there we can uh, I see a sapling back here. We can go grab this real quick. Hopefully that bear's not, like, strolling up here. Oh, there's a backpack, too. That's a maple, too. I think the maple is a... Yeah, the maple is the one you use for the bow. Nothing. Candy bar would have been nice. Oh, there's, there's a deer I'm talking about. And how long does this take? Oh, that's not very long. Cool. So, do we want to grab this deer here? How many calories do you have? Eight minutes? That's not very much. An hour and eight minutes. Uh, I mean, we could start a fire. Can I start a fire, please? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to risk it. This is how we learn, right? So I know the wind's kind of not too keen right now. But I'd like to just give it a shot. 95%. Um, hmm, do I want to drop or do I want to use any more... Any more... Uh, do I want to use the coal? Not anymore, but do I want to use a coal? This weather feels like it's getting worse. Let's uh, put the tea down. I'm going to end up drinking that. Ah, yeah, screw it. Let's add a coal. Let's, run the, let's roll, the, roll the dice. I want to warm up. I need to eat. Right, and we have three minutes past the time. Just go ahead and drink that too. Cool. 
We're warm. Let's go ahead and grab this meat. Eight minutes. It's not a lot of food. But it's um, And we can cook it right now. And hopefully that is uh, in good enough condition that it's not going to make us sick. All right, we have an hour left on the campfire. I really wish I didn't drop all those sticks now. Because <laughs> I really could use them. The rabbit. Any other sticks? And we'll grab these feathers real quick. My game's lagging just a bit. I just want to go up the hill here, see if there's a couple sticks I can grab. Anything to just like add another half hour to the fire. Alright, nothing. Okay. Otherwise, I think we just sit next to the fire. We grab this hide. I'm not too worried about the guts as much as I am the hide. I do want to eat this though. Half hour there. Um, hmm. Does this still take an hour or did thawing it? Yeah, it takes about an hour. I need to add more fuel here. Can I add anything? I don't want to burn another piece of coal though. Eat that. Don't make us sick, please. All right, cool. And then let's go ahead and grab this. Cool. All right, we got a fire. Oh, the day cleared up. All right, I'm going to leave that. The day actually cleared up a little bit. I wasn't expecting that. Maybe we go grab our sticks. Oh, there's another sapling. Oh, I was like, what just expired? Restore condition. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, it's because we made the tea. We can grab this sapling up here. The second maple sapping sapling. I need to watch the condition on this uh, hacksaw too. I don't want to break it. Some more sticks over here. Some more back there too. We got the rabbit I'm walking into the wind. Go inside quick. Grab all these sticks. And then do we try with... I don't think... We don't have enough uh, light to go up to... We don't have enough light to go up to the forestry lookout. But do we want to leave here? I don't really want to sit here. Not with the weather being clear. We still have a couple hours before sundown. I could go back to Trappers. Spend the night there. Huh. It might be worth it to go to Trappers. I can't sleep at the Forestry Lookout. Not the broken one, for sure. And I can't, and even the non-broken one, sleep in there is pushing it. Like, that one gets cold. 
alternatively, we could go to the bunkers, like the, the trailers, rather. But that's kind of out of the way, too. Oh, God, you scared me. Glad I had this torch out. Um, hmm. I don't see the bear. And I'm at Unnamed Pond. So this river gets me back up to the camp office. We could just go there. If I follow this river here, we could just go straight back to the camp office, right? And then from there, tomorrow we could go check out, or even tonight, we could go check out the forestry lookout, which I don't really feel any, there's much up there to go get. Uh, but I want to go to the broken down one. And I see, see those crows right there? Those are probably uh, indicating the the deer carcass, I think. Let's just double check. Make sure that this isn't a, like a corpse right here. It is a corpse right here. How much meat does this guy have? Oh, this is a, a human. Never mind. I don't eat humans. Take that back. Oh, marine flare. And a dog food. Hell yeah. Okay. That was a good find. Thanks, Dennis. All that shit talking I was doing before. Finally, finally uh, stepped up. I appreciate it. I'm going to reset this torch. I think we are going to head back to the camp office. We're close enough. Um, yeah. We got nine torches. Let's use them. We're close enough. We're warm enough. Uh, getting to the camp office isn't too, isn't too bad. We could drop off the uh, deer hide too that we just picked up and the maple sapping saplings. Let them get curing and then kind of we could sleep, maybe make some water if we need to work our way up to uh, then going to the, the lookouts because we need to be on the other side of this hill here to get to the the lookout. Let's grab these reishis too. It's probably not a bad move to start a fire tonight with this torch and get a couple reishis going. Is that coal? Interesting. I'm gonna grab these reishis. There's the like bardock I think it is in this game. I don't know if the bardock is worth harvesting. Let me know if you think it is. I mean, we're not hurting on food right now. Um, I just ate. There's a wolf. We're going to avoid him if we can. But I just ate. And then on top of that, we got that dog food that I just found. Oh, you stay. Oh, there's another sapling. I think those are birch. We might come out here tomorrow. Yeah, there's multiples there, so there's some birch. I'm not going to get it now. I don't really want to be out in this cold any longer. I'm kind of feeling like I should have went and got it. Just scared off the wolf, but I committed. I'm committed to, to getting back to the camp office. Let's drop off our stuff. It's lighting up a little bit. There was plenty of wolves around today, so I just want to get back safely and call that a win. Yeah, there's another wolf right here. I'm going to reset this torch before we, uh, before we try to go over there. All right, cool. And I'm going to go a little wide. He's not detecting me right now, so... 
Let's try to keep that. Keep that going. Stay over there, guy. And we have a stick up here. Which I'm going to grab. Ah, oh, he found me. It's fine. He's far enough away. I'm not too worried about him. And if there's any wolves up on this uh, ledge here, because he's aggro on us, he none of the other ones should uh, should aggro on us. Run, deer, run. You're running right towards a wolf. I wonder if I could make... I probably could make the deer clothing and rabbit clothing without... Probably can make those, like, soon here. I need to eat, too. We're out of calories. Oh, that wolf uh, just aggroed on that deer. And let's just run the rest of the way. Get inside. Before we lose our cold. Cool. Not bad. I want to eat. Make sure we don't lose that well-fed. We've got these guts here. We have these rabbit pelts here. Um, guess we'll just drop the deer hide here. Uh, right here. Yep. Drop that. Cool. Uh, can I put these? No. It's fine. All right. And then we need to cure these saplings. So let's drop these two. Awesome. Oh, no. Um... did it hell yeah clutch okay um we got those saplings going those are curing perfect um let's see what else do we need i got well we can probably deposit these feathers here yep let's put all those there not that it's a ton of weight but um we don't need them on us we're good here, so we'll prepare these today. I'm going to drop off those sticks upstairs. We don't have enough uh, flour for more bannock or bannock. And I don't have any more uh, birch bark to be able to make another tea. But we can start a fire. I think we have like five coal still. I've got more flour up here, so we can use that. Let's uh, Let's go. Let's do it. Start the fire. Should probably be using these books on the floor. It's like 95% with a book. Alright, that worked. Put that there. And we'll add some fuel. An hour there. We'll just add one of these. And I'm going to drop the rest of these off. Do I want to cook? What do I want to cook? Grab that. I think we're going to need to just keep cooking the banak here. Banak, I think, or is it bannock? I'm going to have to Google it. Uh, what do we need? That's fine. Yep, let's cook it. And then let's uh, cook the birch bark tea. I want to drop these sticks off. Perfect. And then let's uh, eat a couple cattails. We need to get some more uh, soon. I don't like having like less than 30. You can eat this dog food. I think we want to eat it. I don't know if you can heat up dog food. I don't think you can. Okay, 20. Okay, this. We can take that. I should have made, rather than eating, I should have uh, prepared the, um, the tea. Make this. I 
and we'll cook that up. And then these are done. Okay, let's see here. We have, in terms of food, we've got 560, 560, 560, 150 times 27. So that's a substantial amount of calories. Ooh. Okay, cool. Um, do we want, what else do we want to make? I mean, do I want to make it? I'll save it for now. Oh, don't drink the tea. Okay, I did it. I drank it. Let's go ahead and... I want to just see the computer. Let's check this out. Log upload 9. Suggests adaptation to the new seasonal high temperatures. Recommended further study to confirm shift in migration. Previous observations confirm their pre their presence. Their, their presence. What are you talking about? Birds? This one's off. Uh, what's this? Oh, because the outside. Alright. Well, interesting. Let's go back upstairs. And then we are going to just stock up. I'm going to cook some water. We need it. So let's go ahead and, and just get a th whole thing of water going. And I'm going to cook some water here, too. We got an hour. We're going to need more than that. Let's just get rid of these. Oops, that was a torch. I wanted to burn these. My fault. Take that, too. I'm going to drop this coal off. Uh, where are you? Cool. Don't roll under the bed, please. Two hours there. We're good here. Just take these torches and let's harvest them all. Oh, I got this other pry bar. You can drop off. I'm gonna drop it here. We'll we'll move it downstairs. Um, I just gotta remember to, but I don't want to like end up leaving the the building and and still carrying those on us. It's a waste of weight. Um, I would like to now spend the next little bit uh, making these. Twenty-one, twenty. Okay. Yeah. And we'll craft this too. Got an hour there. Let's cook some more water. And can we make any more reishis? Yes, we can. Should be able to make two more. We got one there. And 35 and 11. And one more. Cool. That makes me feel better. To have uh, some more teas ready to go. 10 minutes, 21 minutes, or 18 minutes, sorry. Uh, 48% there. Let's, um, let's drink. We got 1.19 gallons. And we're okay on food for the moment. 
should just bring this downstairs. I don't think there's anything in the immediate area that I want to search uh, with an Aurora on. I don't want to brave the wolves. I think I have like three of these right now. Yeah, three. I got three par pry bars. I got two heavy hammers. But I don't think there's anything outside that's worth checking out with the the Aurora going on. Eight minutes and five minutes. Take that and let's take that too. Let's go ahead and make these teas now. Heat, uh, I don't want to heat that up. I want to cook that. And I want to cook that. Got an hour. We can drop the birch bark. I would like to. We could place a gallon. I'll move that in the morning when I can see. And uh, it feels good to be restocking a little bit here. And cool. I'm going to get these teas going. I think I got another two or three I can do. And then I think I'm going to probably read some of the night away until this Aurora ends. And then uh, I think the next move after that's to go to bed and uh, we'll kick things off in the morning. All right. Good morning, everybody. So... We did manage to make all of our teas and uh, ride out that Aurora. R pretty much finished the teas and uh, I tried to repair my boots and the Aurora stopped, so it was dark. So now I'm gonna try to do this here today. I gotta eat real quick um, before we do that though. And the weather doesn't sound the best outside. So I want to try to eat because I don't want to burn all my calories and lose well-fed. But we do need to get these boots repaired um, sitting at 46%. If I were to repair these, it takes 30 minutes. I wish it told me how many calories it burns. But 30 minutes isn't that long, so we should be fine. And you ruin the leather. God dang it, man. All right, well, nothing I could do. I only had one piece. I could break these down, uh, but I bet you it's going to take like an hour to break them apart. Harvest. Yeah, an hour and a half for one. Really not that worth it. Uh, the only reason I don't really care for the combat boots is they're just so heavy. I mean, these boots are two, they're half the weight. So it's just, to me, it's, I, I want the carry capacity. Honestly, I don't, I mean, I know that can protect me in a wolf, but generally if I'm, uh, how much is this? Generally, if I'm uh, going to be attacked by a wolf, I'm going to be dead anyways, uh, with where we are in terms of gear. So, um, it doesn't really make sense to sacrifice the weight because the protection's likely not going to do much to circumvent my death. Uh, we'll move these here. Let's kind of get them out of the way. Uh, we got a bunch of stuff here. I want to break these torches down. They suck. Um, and what do we want to do here? I think the plan was to go get the those saplings. And then... Let's see how bad the weather is, though. Uh, go get the saplings, and then maybe check out the horseshoe lookouts. Oh, yeah, perfect day. This is great. All right, we're going to be inside for a little while. Uh, we'll try to read, like, for an hour and um, ride out the storm. Uh, I would like to go get those birch saplings, at least, and then go get the, and maybe another deer hide or two, if I can. Um, where's my book? Here it is. Alright, storm's dead. Only took an hour. 
so we didn't lose too much time. It's going to be cold. It's always cold. Yeah, all right. So it's cold, but it's clear. I'm going to start a fire and just get these teas warmed up. And then we will be off. Let's grab a couple sticks and let's start that fire. Uh, torch. We will light this. All right, cool. That's only going to be a couple minutes here. Let's go ahead and drop that stick that I just had. We got 30 pounds of carry weight. And we're doing okay. I mean, this isn't too terrible. I think we can leave this flare. Um, yeah, I think we can leave that. Uh, we got a couple waters here. And I'm good on water. I'm good on tea. Uh, any spoiled food over here? I could probably eat that. 100%. 100%. How about you? 36%. That's fine. Like, I got ingredients over here. Uh, this is my spoiled food area where we will eat once we get cooking five. Uh, these are just about done. Uh, let's just pass time and get them ready and pick them up. And let's go. I think we're out. We don't need anything else. Maybe I should light one of these torches. Can I pick up the torch, please? Oh, wait. Yeah, let's just equip it. Yeah, let's light this up. Save ourselves the match. And if we're in the clear, we can always just discard it. If not, then at least we're covered for the wolves. That one's ruined. I forgot to go break that down. And we're off. Oh, I need to drink the tea. Yeah, reishi. I didn't check our condition today. Okay, we are near full. That's not too bad. I don't see any wolves around, so that's also good, because they were all over here yesterday. And I'd like to go try to get the, the birch saplings that we saw down here uh, towards Unnamed Pond and Frozen Creek. And maybe do the trailers. There is a corpse for a deer. Oh, there's two wolves right there. Three wolves right there. Um, hmm. Well, I just don't want to dance with them and waste the time if I can avoid it. So let's try to go around. I'm not concerned that, like, we're going to get mauled. Just really don't want to have to kind of do this tussle and then waste our day um, circumventing them, getting them to run off, and even worse, imagine this wind blows out our torch. We're screwed. So we'll go a little, little high and um, and around and make our way maybe over to the trailers. Got to reset this torch here. Uh, torch down here. We'll drop it and use. Oh. Well, then wasn't wasn't quick enough. We have one out in case we need it. Uh, but now I'm not gonna I'm not gonna um, light this one up. We'll just wait. Hopefully, it's not too windy. Interesting little stick. Uh, high ground works though. There's no not going to be any wolves up here. And down this way. And I wonder if the moose is back. I would like to murder him. I need my bow first. Let's see. Okay. I hear crows. That's because of the deer. We could start the fire and harvest the deer hide now. But I kind of want to just go 
skip this deer for now. Like, this is one I would say we grab on the way back. No real sense in, um... There's no real sense in us grabbing this hide and carrying it all over the place. When we know it's here, we just grab what we need from the other areas and then on our way back through, we can we can go ahead and grab this deer. Now the question is, do I want to go to the dam first and go get the tools? Or do I want to just go to the lookout? The reason I want the tools is because I can't repair the hacksaw without the tools and we have the scrap to do so. So, I mean, I don't, we're not going to burn through our hacksaw uh, today. Like, we have enough condition on it. Um, I think we're at like 48% uh, between the, the saplings and the deer carcasses. We're not going to tank all of that. It uses a lot of its condition when you use it on the, the metal. So, we have time, is what I'm saying. But, regardless, I would like to get it and have it, because I don't want to be, you know, trying to run out later and grab it if we're already over here. Should probably go up this way, get the high ground, make sure that there's no bear. And we could, there's some rose hips over by the trailers too we could grab. Let's grab this stick. There's, um, we're going to want to keep up our teas. Our teas are probably cold now. Um, but, I mean, it's staved off a lot of our cold today. Let's see, anything around the corner here? No. There's the trailers. We're kind of coming through the back. There's not going to be wolves up here, but there can be wolves behind the trailer, so we just want to... Be mindful of that. What is that? Oh, it's, is that is that a corpse? No, that's just terrain. Be careful. Oh, I knew it. As soon as I said it. As soon as I said it. Oh, like we're gonna sprain our leg. I love spraining my leg. Oh, I love doing it twice. Anything dangerous? I don't even think I have... I mean, I gotta have bandages on me, right? Ugh, come on, man. I freaking hate it. Just listening real quick. Ugh. Alright, we're at the logging camp. I don't want to be out here like this, in this condition. I do want that. Let's just put it right here in the middle of the floor. So I don't forget. Let's go inside. And uh, see what's here. There's probably a lantern in here somewhere. Alright, we can put this away. Any med kit? No. Alright, what are we what are we looking at for afflictions? Pain 2. And sprained ankle. I sprained both my ankles. We'll wrap them up tight. And we'll do the other one. Alright. At least that helps me with the hobbling. I can deal with the pain. I just search that. Grab this. It's only a couple hours a little of blurriness on the screen. It's fine. Uh, I don't know if that makes the wolves more interested in me. Like this pain effect. Are, uh, consider us to be weaker to a wolf. Can they sense that? Alright, we're good here. What's in this one? This is the one that usually has the the pry bar. Let's 
sports vest. Don't need it. I'll take the soda, though. Give me the soda. Thank you. Uh, nothing on these shelves here. How about under the bed in this plastic container? Uh, that's empty. Oh, another marine flare. Hey, Dennis. You got a pair of jeans for me? Nope. Uh, what's that? Oh, the sunlight. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, some more water purification tablets. That's good. What else? Uh, we got a container here. Okay, nothing. Um, not seeing anything there. And we'll check up here real quick. All right, cool. Yeah, usually there's like a lantern or a pry bar right up here. Um, what did I want to do? You know what? I'm just going to take these. Doesn't really matter. I'm carrying them anyways. Like, let's just take them. Uh, and then I want to eat because we are going to lose our well fed if I don't. Uh, we do one more, maybe? Yeah, let's go ahead. They lose condition real quick, though. Like, it's like 75 to 52 already. I want to search that one. I want to grab these rose hips, though. And I'm probably going to grab this log. We have the weight right now. And if I do find a carcass, I'm going to need to, um, start a fire. Let's grab these real quick so we can prepare them and let's head over to this other trailer and then the question is do I start a fire and heat up these teas before we before we go and I'm thinking the answer might be yes anything on these shelves another log there's a bunch of containers in here. Maybe we get lucky. Some newspaper, some lantern fuel. Take the lantern fuel. Leave the newspaper. Nothing in this other container here. And nothing in this drawer. Uh, nothing on these shelves. They're bare. There is a book back here. More guns. Don't have any guns. So that'll get burnt also. What else we got here? Okay. Um, what time is it? Oh, it's already mid. The day's already almost over. Um, do I want to start a fire and heat up the teas? I think I do. Probably want to start it in this building here. To A, get us out of the wind, but B, because I can cook like multiple. Oh, I guess I could heat up the teas either way, right? I was thinking, like, I could heat up the teas on the stovetop, but. It's the fire, like, pit that you make is the same number of burners. <laughs> and I can just leave the teas on the ground. It doesn't really matter, but we're out of the, uh, we're out of the, the wind, at least. Can you put this away? Thank you. All right, let's, uh, yeah, let's burn this reclaimed wood. And we'll add a couple sticks. Go ahead and place our cooking pot and I will cook no I don't want to cook that oh I guess I do just drop this and we'll drop this and I think I need to make the the um, rose hips so let's go ahead and do that now Yep. 15 minutes. We can do that. Those teas won't burn. It should be good, though. Yep. Yeah, perfect. Okay. And let's go ahead and cook the rose hip. 
30 minutes left on this fire. We are warming up slowly. Do I have anything else to gather? I don't want to drink that. Um, <laughs> drop one of these rocks. Okay. Yeah, let's just uh, go. Take that. Let's drink this. And uh, let's grab this and this. And we'll grab a torch. And let's be on our way. Oh, almost left that. Yep, let's take that with us. Okay. Very good. So. The sun is going to set here soon. Uh, it is the warmer part of the day. I still would like to kind of achieve our goal to go get the the um, deer hide and also the saplings. That's our last building on our way. The forestry lookout up here, the burnt down one, is going to have some ropes to climb gonna have some other gear well when I say ropes to climb we can climb down once we get up there like as a quick shortcut and we could always head back to these trailers tonight to sleep I'm just kind of thinking out loud too while we go so we could get up there get the hide I'm not seeing where there would be more saplings I mean they could be over there the only real concern is the bear over here. Um, and there, But there's a deer around. I'm not too worried about the bear. He will bumble down this roadway here. But we should be able to see him before he sees us. The rope comes out over here. Uh, so we could, you know, come down this way and go. Uh, but if we go up the... Is that the bear? I think that's the bear. Um, is that him? Or is that a log? Can't tell. Is it moving? No, I'm moving. I think that's the log. Um, let's grab another torch. We're still warm. This is the log cutter area. There's the bear. He's walking in place. Little Michael Jackson bear. Moonwalking. And let's see. Okay, we got the sticks. I'm gonna just give him a wide berth. Uh, it's never good to dance with the bear. Um, but we will go up and around. Uh, I'm still, like I said, on track to just go get the do the lookout. Uh, basically, I just need to come down around here and then go up the hill up to this lookout over here. I do want to maybe pop another tea if it's still warm. I'm really not too happy that we don't have any more mushrooms. We are like on pace together, man. And I do not want to sprain my ankle again. I hate this game. This will be my last playthrough. Screw this game. I'm so sick of it doing that to me. I'm going to come around. There's a backpack usually behind that sign, but I'm not going to risk it with a bear. I just want to get up this hill and then maybe jump down the side here. Yeah, we're good. So this is the pathway up to the lookout. Basically, you come down around this side and you'll make your way up and then where that bear was and there's a sign. You'll walk up and just follow the fence. It'll guide you. Um, I can 
Uh, I can bandage up this foot, but it's not. It doesn't really make sense to right now. We're just there's nothing up here. Generally, there aren't any wolves. Um, the only real reason I'm keeping this torch going is because I can use it to start the fire I'm going to need to start. Uh, to harvest the deer. I would like, and if we have a little bit of luck, I don't know if there are any mushrooms up here or any rose hips. But if we could find a couple, I would like another tea or two. I'm using them faster than I am making them. Oh, we're hobbling. Come on, man. I don't want to hobble no more. Come on. It's right there, though. Like, that's the radio tower. There's usually a wood bin up here, too, I think. If I remember. And then they'll supply us with a rope to get down. So we don't have to walk this whole trek and go by the bear again. Condition's fine, temperature's fine, food's fine. Water and energy are fine. We're doing pretty good. Oh, there's ptarmigans up here too. I don't have any salt though. I forgot about that. I should have grabbed a salt with me. I mean, I can just kill them and bring them back with us. But I just didn't want to be smelly. All right, we're here. Destroyed lookout. Where are they? Oh, right there. Um, this ain't gonna work. <laughs> Told you. Okay. Well, that's fine. Uh, let's grab this reclaimed. Oh, there's a memento key. What is that? Climb in the cave. Okay. I don't know where that is. I really got to learn where those are. I only know the one in um, Desolation's Point. There's the deer. So let's get this fire started. I don't know. I think I might want to reset this torch. Uh, yep. Cool. Now we don't have to worry about it. We just start. We start this fire. And yep, we got this one here. Oh, I, all I have is birch bark. Um, okay, screw it. I don't really like to use birch bark as tinder, but we're ill prepared. So we're going to today. I got an hour on that. Let that defrost a little bit. Let's grab these feathers. Nothing there. There was another feather here and here. Uh, we will break that down here in a bit. Let's grab this. And can I get this one? Eight. And what's that? Another eight? Sixteen total? Another feather. And what's in the supply bin? This should be where the rope is. Yeah. Oh, ragged work gloves. Okay. Pretty sure there's nothing up there. Uh, 57. We're going to deploy this. Shouldn't kill our hunger. It's killing our temperature, though. All right. We warm up over here. Ooh, it's, we're cold. We're still cold. Okay, that's not good. I didn't think we would be this cold. We get a little bit more heat output there. Yeah, all right, perfect. Cool. Um, I will like to... Oh, it's going to take 15 minutes. Don't burn.
Come on. All right. And then lastly, what I'd like to do is prepare. Oh, is it? We, it's not enough. I think we need like 30. Well, then what am I going to do? Okay. Uh, if I were to harvest this... Come on. I'm watching that food meter r real quick. Okay, got that. And let's eat. Okay, ate a couple cattails. Got an hour 27 minutes there. Let's go ahead and get this hide. Wait, check these real quick. Yep, just make sure. And let's go ahead and harvest. Let's watch our heat. We're good. Food's fine. Cool. And we were going to eat this too. Good, good, good. Okay. We'll take this with us and this. Uh, let's grab... I'm going to take a... Let's heal ourselves up real quick. Sprained ankle. And the pain. We got one hour left in the pain. I'm going to leave it. But we are going to use a bandage. Just so we can walk, right? Cool. And then let's take a torch. Put this out. Take another torch. Let's grab these couple feathers here. Thank you. And then lastly, I just want to run up here real quick. I just can never remember if there's anything. Yeah, there is something here. Okay, I can never remember if there's anything of, like, interest up here. There's just the Polaroid. Uh, we're good. We went through all that. I searched that already. We searched this. Uh, there's no other needs up here that I can think of. I'm just going to take a look, make sure nothing's down there to kill me. And let's climb down. Basically, I, at this point, I want to get over to the trailers, I think. I wonder if we can actually go the opposite direction and get over to the... Um, I wonder if this comes out by Frozen Creek. Get to Flatland before I snap another ankle and throw my computer out the window. Yeah, this does look like it comes over to Frozen Creek. Cool, so now we got a way back up there if we ever wanted to. Um, but, since we're over by Frozen Creek, we can double back, grab those saplings, and then we can call that a day. Um, this is exactly what I wanted and kind of achieved all the goals today. I love when that happens. Uh, we're not in the clear yet. We could always still be uh, murdered, but... I don't have to go back. Oh, you bitch. Leave me alone, man. I want to go down here. I want to scare him the other way. If I can. Come on. Oh, don't go that way. Ugh. Literally the way I didn't want you to go. It doesn't make sense. Why you would run that way. It really doesn't. Like, an animal... Like, you're, you think the instinct of the animal would be 
if you're dangerous and I don't like fire to run the opposite direction of where you came from. Oh, we'll just do this and get rid of that pain. Okay, I'm going to reset this torch. And then the saplings are right there. Let's grab another torch here. Light it up. Try not to use a match like I sometimes do. And we're going to grab these saplings right here. There's three of them. Should be quick. I'm going to keep the torch on me so the wolves don't bother me. Oh no, they're maples. Well, I mean, it doesn't hurt. But it's not what I was looking for. <laughs> I need the birch. Is that birch over there? I don't know if those are saplings either. I mean, those are not saplings for sure, but I don't know if there are any saplings. Okay. I don't see any more. I thought the maples all, uh, I thought the maples grew independently and not in groups. So I assume that those were birch, but they are not. Uh, we have enough, uh, warmth to probably make it home. We're going to be a little cold, but we will recover whatever condition, uh, we lose once we get there. Just got to keep this torch going. Make sure we get home safely. And then I think that's going to do it. Um, we did not get the birch saplings we wanted to, but we do have a couple maples. Um, I need to look at the travois too, because I know that requires saplings. So it might be the maples that we need. And then we at least know we have that pretty much set up. Uh, the travois also, I believe, requires a deer, a deer pelt. So... Uh, we just got two of those today, and so we have it, <laughs> essentially. We have what we would need to make that, um, which is going to help. See, I told you I'd do that. I told you. Um, which is going to help for us to get around. So all in all, it's a pretty solid episode. These... Three wolves are probably still over here. Um, I will try to circumvent them, but we're definitely gonna we're gonna trigger this guy here. Yep. There's nothing I could do about it. This come on. Chase me. Yeah, I'm good, I'm in the fire here. Get out of here. We'll equip and let's keep moving. And yeah, all in all, it was a, a good day, I think. we The weather held out, which was nice. We were able to get accomplished everything that we wanted to. Um, I wanted to get that other deer hide. Just keeping hear noises. Yeah, there's a wolf over there. Alright, he's aggro on me. We're good. Um, I wanted to get that other deer hide, but that's not... Uh, like pertinent there's just a want right same thing with the um the tools i do want to get the tools from the dam but it's not gonna change our run anything uh in any way today if we were to get them it's just something i want to have the peace of mind of knowing that i have it so i can just repair the uh, the hacksaw and be done i don't like to I really don't like to keep things at low condition, you know, 25%, whatever. I want the, I want my stuff to be, you know, in the 80s, 90s. Okay, we can drop that. And then let's drop these over here. Very good. And let's reset this torch so I can see what I'm doing today. And let's go put these feathers in here. We got plenty of feathers, plenty of stuff. Yeah, use 1% to do what we did today. It's not killing us. Um, it's just really for my peace of mind. So we got the two deer hides and 
we're gonna go upstairs basically and uh look to go to bed and then i think in the next episode we're gonna go down to muskeg and get smelting i'll probably take uh the stuff with me here like i'll grab this i already have a cooking pot there so i'll leave this cooking pot here i don't need it we can drop this one but i will take no <laughs> i will take that with me um to have it it's uh like i said if we're gonna make the banak and stuff we're gonna need the frying pan so we i'm all over the place can't click buttons today we'll take that with us and we'll probably take these flowers and i'll probably take a salt with me just to have it and uh we'll go from there but that's gonna do it for me uh, if you enjoyed the episode, please drop a like. It helps me out very, very much. If you're interested in more Long Dark content, please consider subscribing. And I will see you all in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.